Here's my Admiral 19A11 from the late 40s. A recent gift from my grandfather. And it's all complete. Cabinet's in good shape. It's got a pretty good back on it. I've still got to work on the speaker area. It's still a little bit dirty, but it's got all the knobs and everything. I would like to get a new faceplate for the CRT, as well as the CRT is a little bit weak. But it produces a pretty decent picture in low light. All ready for a power up after replacing all out of tolerance components, cleaning tube sockets, replacing bad tubes, and cleaning the pots and tuner. And here's the underside of the set showing all the capacitors replaced along with the out of tolerance resistors and some bad wiring replaced as well. Here's all the components that came out of it that I replaced. Yeah, it's just like this guidance, you know, you, you just guide them into appreciating just the good things in life and the things that will give them true happiness. And uh, someday you got to let them go, and, that's, and, and it's hard. It's hard to let them go. Guide your car to true happiness, Chevron with Tecron. I'm a crier. I mean, just thinking about it makes me cry. Looking at the passer when Ellert makes the move to the outside, that's when he looks back and picks up Everett and picks up the ball. That's a great play. Well, we have seen some nice plays by the Saints corners tonight. It's an excellent coverage on these Ram receivers. Well, they got a young one coming up that looks awfully good out there, too. Number 26. Ben Stock, he's made some great plays tonight. Yeah, I don't know if they can afford to get him on special teams. Gary on second. I promise you this, Norton. I'm going to learn. I'm going to learn from here on in how to swallow my pride. Well, that ought not to be too hard. You've learned how to swallow everything else. Had a bit of good fortune on the search for a good CRT bezel. I took a gamble on a part set off of eBay. And the pictures on the uh, eBay ad showed a nice clear CRT bezel. So I just went ahead and bought it. And when it got here, I took it apart and polished up the CRT bezel. And just for kicks, I tried out the CRT. It ended up being a strong one. So i got a good CRT in the set now, too, and it's working quite a bit better. I've got it hooked up to a VCR out here in the workshop and the VCR has got an antenna hooked up to it picking up signal from my blonder tongue agile modulator. And I've been using this set pretty regular here since I got the CRT installed and it's, it's working pretty well. Seems like it gets better the more I use it.
Now for my test pattern, I just took a picture of one off of my computer screen and I can hook it up to my VCR. Got it hooked into the line 2 input. And there it is. Overall it looks pretty decent. It's off a little bit on the first few lines, but towards the bottom it's pretty even. But not enough to really worry about. Overall it's working great for what it is and I'm pretty happy with it so I'm just going to enjoy it. And my Agile modulator is set to channel 5. Sir, then I'm the uh, officer of witness. If you go back on her property, you will be arrested, okay? Do you have any questions about that? Yeah. Not too much on TV these days. But I got a bunch of VHS tapes all, with all kinds of shows that I can watch. I don't know. Has he got fit for rabies? Maybe that's a question you should have asked instead of. Uh, you know, calling the scene out in the street with her.